Now, Sunta Ng has been selected as the recipient of the 2011 University of Washington Charles E. Odegaard Award. Founder and publisher of the Seattle Chinese Post and Northwest Asian Weekly, Asunta Ng has devoted her life to promoting and mentoring young women and youth. Born and raised in China, Asunta came to study at the University of Washington as a young adult. Her tireless volunteerism and leadership in Seattle's community empower the goals of both the Office of Minority Affairs and Diversity and the Educational Opportunity Program. Well, when Sheila called me about the award, uh, the first thing in my mind, I didn't say too much over the phone, but the first thing in my mind was, are you sure I'm the right person? <laughs> Asunta is deserving because she is embodies that commitment to inclusion, equity, and social justice that the award tries to um, capture. She is about including everyone um, of all ages, races. She's about honoring people. Uh, she is about empowering the next generation, which this Odegaard Award really does um, try and capture people who support that next generation of leaders in our community. So Asuna has a master's degree in communication, and so uh, she's an alum of the Department of Communication, and so we started having her come to classes, meet with students, uh, try and give them advice about their careers. and. Overwhelmingly, she gave them the advice that if they worked hard enough and really aspired to succeed, they would. And I've seen students really moved by her own experiences, by her own story. She has never, I don't think, ever accepted no as an answer. But she doesn't take center stage. She's behind the scenes, yeah. but she's everywhere. Yeah. And if you go to like one of the dinners that she's helped organize, she's there, and then she's over there, yeah. and she's over there, yeah. and, and it's like she never stops. I was at a luncheon uh, where Asunta was honoring women, and the women all start talking about the impact that actually Asunta had had on their lives. And she was almost um, embarrassed to be, to have someone talk about all of the wonderful things that she does because she does like to be behind the scenes. So to, to bring her out from behind the scenes and say what you've been doing is really amazing work and is empowering our community in the same way that you've honored all those thousands of other people who've um, empowered our community is quite a shift for her. Overwhelming. It really is overwhelming because Charles Olegard was the president when I went to school there. And what this award represents means that um, I have to do more. So I have to look back at what I'm doing. Um, I haven't been doing enough. So I need to contribute more, not only to the University of Washington, but to the community. She, she came here as um, an immigrant and has been a champion for all of those who have come behind her. And she's been a role model for, for many people along the way. And she doesn't even realize the impact that she's having on people's lives just by being who she is every day. Five minutes, guys, five minutes. Get ready. Put Smoke on your pretty. best smile. Yeah, put on your best smile. You know, we always work, 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 and not do things for fun. So I like to do things for fun too. So I create fun for myself by having a children's parade for Lunar New Year in costume. So in that way, we bring the kids to appreciate their cultures, and also it's a good way for parents and kids to do things together. Hello, everyone! <laughs> the words I'd use to describe Asunta is um, really dedicated, very positive, and most of all, determined. She's had a, an impact on a number of generations, intergenerational impact, from young people to um, elementary, middle school, high school, college, and professionals. We have so much to learn from one another, and we have so much at stake if we don't help the other. I think that um, 
Asunda has this remarkable s skill or style where um, she comes across as a, a pretty kind person, uh, almost gentle, but she has, um, uh, there's a force of nature there. Being a husky means to learn, to grow, and to inspire. 